For Michigan State and Ohio State from the Breslin Center today, MSU coming in at 12-4 overall. They are 2-1 in conference play, and Ohio State enters at 14-4. They are 4-0 in conference action this season. Jan Costa at the top, comes off a screen, triggers a three, and knocks it down. Three away from tying the mark, four away from taking Ariel Powers' seat as the top scorer in program history. I really think she knew she'd break the record. I'm sure it was in the back of her mind. It's something she wanted to do, but she would rather win that game scoring six points than scoring 42 and losing, you know. So, but to be able to do it in a hat trick kind of way, I guess, you know, to break the single season, to break the overall record and then turn around and beat the 11th ranked team in the country is pretty cool. This win was so huge for us. I mean, we needed a win against a top team, uh, a top 25 team, and um, to get it against Ohio State at home was, you know, amazing. It's an exciting game, um, and the most important part was us getting a win. It's important for us in the Big Ten race. It's important to us to get, gain some confidence and protect our home court, and to be able to do the two records on a night where we get a top 15 win for our RPI, uh, for postseason, and for seeding the Big Ten tournament, and really a quest for a Big Ten championship is the most important part. I hope that they can see that you know it's a really good basketball team that we beat here and that if we share the ball and we defend and rebound and play with great energy and effort and compete, really good things can happen. And I think they're starting to buy into their roles and understand kind of what we're trying to accomplish at both ends of the floor. Martin Twin, 94-75. Jan Costco with a program record, 42 points tonight. Sets the program scoring mark this evening, and MSU gives Ohio State their first Big Ten loss.